What's up YouTube, 2 for T here, and in today's episode I am going to be trying to, trying to get my, one of my cluster instruments to work, which would be the engine temperature, or the coolant temperature, yeah, the engine temperature, coolant temperature, whatever. Uh, I have to try to make that work. Um, I don't feel too comfortable, you know, test driving the car or even really starting it and letting it warm up to get the operating temp if I don't know exactly how hot the engine's getting. So right now, uh, I'm gonna just set you guys up underneath the, the dash and tell you guys what's up. So as you can see, there's a whole bunch of spliced and cut wires from the previous owner that I had purchased this S12 from. And I did some research and found out that my coolant temp wire because this car had a VG30 in it, not a CA. I thought it had a CA20E in it. Looked at the firewall and it said VG30E. So I looked up some wiring schematics and I found out that the coolant temp wire for the, for the cluster, not to the ECU, is purple with the white stripe. And uh, I found that right here. Uh, if I move the camera closer, uh, the shadow gets in the way, but right here what I'm, what I'm tugging on, yeah, if you can see that, if you can see right here that I have this this uh, green wire hooked up to, this was actually already cut, the purple wire. Uh, I really don't know if that's even the wire, but uh, if since it was already cut from the previous owner, I'm assuming that he already tried to do what I'm about to do right now, so I just hooked this up real quick. I just twisted the wires together just to see. I'm going to extend this wire all the way to my temp sensor for the cluster on the on the engine and then I'm going to warm the engine up and see if the gauge moves so I'm going to go ahead and do that and we'll be back all right guys so I got my um the wire hooked up it's this wire right here running all the way through. Uh, you can't really see because all other wires, but uh, it runs through. It's that one right there. Ugh. Sorry. It's that wire right here. It runs all the way to the temp where that black plug's removed. Oh shit! Wow, I just hit the <laughs> I just hit the fan, and now my thing fell off. Wow. All right. So right there that's where I got the temp sensor hooked up to and that's for the cluster the red one is temperature sensor to the ECU for operating purposes and then that's the, the the wire right there that you see that I have hooked up is for the temperature sensor to the cluster so I get a reading so I'm gonna let this warm up for a little bit and we'll see if she shows me some good news on the dash some good fucking news Sorry about my cursing, but God, Jesus fucking Christmas. That shit is working. Look at that. It was at the sea, engine's warming up right now, and I'm getting a freaking reading. So now I got engine temp in my cluster. Uh, uh, like, that's awesome. That, that is awesome. That's just one more step to the goal. Uh, my uh, voltage gauge works, speedo doesn't work, tack doesn't work, uh, but that's all gonna come in time. Uh, I'll figure out all those wires and do that in, in later videos for when I actually want the car to be a car and not just a project, you know, if you know what I'm talking about. But, yo, I have a freaking temperature reading just from that. Just from that, that guy cut the exact wire I needed. He helped me out. Thank you. Woo! Yo, that is awesome. That is so freaking awesome. Oh, my God. So, uh, that's awesome. Wow. It was that simple. So, <laughs> I got temperature. That's all. That's sick. Well, this was a little video. I like making little videos, you know. I'm gonna start doing this more often. Anytime I'm doing something real tiny, I'll record it and just put it up just because, just because I wanna show you guys what I'm doing and how the build's going step by step, you know. Now that I got the bulk of all the stuff, you know, the engine and everything and the suspension done, 
you know, now I can show you guys, you know, what I what else I have to do. So like and subscribe if you like watching me do car things or if you like me as a person and have a nice day.